everybody and welcome back to the poor man's chemist in this video we are going to attempt to dissolve europium metal in liquid ammonia anhydrous liquid ammonia or as anhydrous as I can get it we are using nerd rages ammonia generator here the urea and sodium hydroxide we have it going up through a reflux condenser that has ice water being used as coolant comes up here through a tube full of potassium hydroxide gas comes down through here there's this trap here to catch any liquid off the potassium hydroxide if it becomes um, deliquescent and liquefies and the test tube here where we will be liquefying ammonia um, the beaker is full of acetone and Jesus Christ that ammonia generator is really going now I am going to go ahead and Put some dry ice in this bad boy, and let's get this party started. Oh, look at that. It's spilling all over. Oh, don't let it get in the test tube. That's fine. We'll get another one. <laughs> I have plenty. Yeah, not trying to... Not trying to no, you're good. You're good. Get, what you call it. There we go. Not well, trying damn. to get impurities into it. What just broke? The, the pipette. Oh. Well, fuck you, pipette. Wait, it all it already disappeared. It's fine. It's getting cold now. Okay. Would you make sure that piece of shit is focused? Tap the screen yeah. once. My, I have the same interface on my phone. Okay. Cool. Yay! Somebody else knows how to work this thing. And I somebody else to vouch for me that the phone, re this camera, really is a total piece of shit. I am vindicated. <laughs> That's why I asked why the camera like sh like shuttered even though it's staying in place. Okay. Whoa. Hey. Oh, okay. I don't know if that's actual ammonia or if that's part of the acetone. No, I think that is it. Yeah, I didn't see any acetone go in the test tube. I, did, I didn't either. I was careful to keep let it not go into this one. The dry ice disappears fast. It never really does that in water. No, I know. That's why it surprised me. This is my first time doing this, too. I'm, I'm a little surprised myself. But hey, you know, that's how it, we roll on this channel. We try different shit we've never done before. And try not to kill ourselves. Yes, absolutely, absolutely right. And how my my young friend here is knows exactly what he's talking about. <laughs> All right, yeah, it's happening. Bring you in here and show you guys this. Look at that. I bet every tweaker's got a meth boner looking at that. <laughs> oh my god, liquid anhydrous ammonia! Ah! Although, that also means we just enabled a bunch of tweaker weirdos. <laughs> Showing them how to do it. <laughs> That's okay, I'm gonna retreat to my normal defense in that, um, it shit's already out there on YouTube, so... I'm not showing you anything new. Alright, we'll zoom in a little bit. There we go. Look at this shit! The bubbles, like... They disappear before they even make it to the surface. I don't know. I hope that's showing up. It is. That is so fucking cool. Oh, that is so cool. When you want to drop them, I guess we'll just go ahead and drop it in. See what happens. Here we go. I'm gonna. I'm not gonna hold it because I don't know what it's gonna do. I'll. I'll hold it after it's done doing its thing here. Well, you have okay. little plants over there to get. Well, it's not violent. Okay. What have we got? Is it doing anything? Just wiggle it around. Alright, you ready to try to bury him? Mm, how much liquid is in there? We got enough. We can do it. Here, just make sure the camera's focused and everything. Yeah. We're good to go. Oh, 
Don't tell me it's doing the same thing. Oh, wait. Yeah, it's definitely working, oh, I think. Oh, yeah, that is working. Shake it one more time. Okay, well, first of all, let's check our barium. Look at that shit. Look at that. There's like so many particles around it. Did it, does, did it like, I think it broke it up, didn't it? Yeah, but it's in solution, dude. That is barium dissolved in liquid ammonia. Look towards the bottom. Look towards the bottom. Yeah, there's lots of chunks. No, no, but look at the copper color. Oh. Oh. Oh, nice. Oh, that is the shit! It's not like a bronze color like it would be with sodium and potassium, but it's like... Like a, a copper color. Wow! That's amazing. That's fucking cool! Oh, that is just... Okay, so after all of our experiments are concluded, we have the europium compound. And you have to look at the bottom here. I'll tell you what, can you lift it up and I'll, I'll tilt this up? Yeah, there we go. All right, hold it right there. I hope it's showing up. But you can see the dark color, the dark bluish color. Focus, like, move, move it back a little bit. If you move, focus more on that. Move it back a little bit. Like that? Oh. Move, move back a little bit. I'm looking at it. No, dude, we're, we're backlit by the sky. I need, there you go. <laughs> there we go. All right, perfect. Now, you guys can see the blue of the europium dissolved in the ammonia. The barium is a lot more impressive. Let's show them that one. Yeah, yeah, lighting out here completely. Uh, just uh, don't worry about it. Just stick it in the other one. It doesn't matter. We're not trying to make pure compounds or anything. Yeah, me, I'm more. We're just like a, we're just trying like to we're just trying to see. make them. Okay, now here is the barium, and you can see the beautiful dark copper compound we've got on that. Oh, I'm gonna zoom in so they can behold its glory. Look at that. And then there's the blue color towards the top. Look at that. You can see more of the blue color on this side. That is so fucking epic, man. Go, I can't believe Look at that. Sun. Yeah, that is so great. I can't. That worked out so, so great. Oh, you must be like my good luck charm, dude. <laughs> they both ended up working. Oh, that is so fucking epic. Well, if you like that video, give it a thumbs up. And if you didn't like it, you can kiss my white ass. I've always wanted to say that. Subscribe, comment, share the video, donate a few bucks if you can. These experiments are expensive. And until the next one, y'all, I'll see you later. So I just asked myself, what happens if you drop a test tube full of, like, barium amide and shit into water? This might be an extraordinarily okay, bad idea, is, but let's find out. That's, uh, that's right? is, uh... Now, ammonia is pretty polar. Here we go. Oh, yeah, because of the... Is that it? Really? Oh, man. Well, that was kind of anticlimactic. Hmm. Is it just because the water can't get in there? I think so. I think the side with the fun stuff is being prevented from touching the water. We should fix that. Wow. Now we know. It turns white. Well, that was kind of cool, I guess. Oh, look, it's there's barium reacting yeah, with don't water. Yeah, white stuff to be an amide. It would have to be a ropium two amide. Okay, maybe I probably yes, I would think so. This is just barium reacting with water.
react away, little barium chunk. Oh, man. <laughs> maybe, I, maybe I could take a hold of it. But that stuff must be a europium 2A mod because that would um, that would have like that would be non-polar, so it wouldn't be like soluble. That well, one I'm actually a little worried yeah, about. Let's find out. Oh, oh, yellow. <laughs> Oh, that was nose raping. <laughs> oh, 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 look! Some fire. That was no, that's gold. That's look gold. at that. Look at that color. Oh, shit. Oh, that's a... oh, that burns. Whatever it is, it is really alkaline. <laughs> ow! Lots of ammonia. Ow, 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 ow. Oh, I don't even care if that was nose raping. That, that's worth a little nose rape.